All right. All right. All right, where to? Ooh, the gym has Kakar. Oh. I get to go first. This is so exciting. Oh, you want to you want to date the uh, cat girl? Yeah, you can try uh, if you if you pursue the cat girl. Although I don't know what happens. I have no idea what happens. Are I've you actually sure that. you can actually date the cat girl? I have no clue. I don't know. I don't have any money. So I would just yeah, be going to the cat girl like to be like Hi, ba hey, hey baby. Yeah, hey baby. <laughs> Maybe you should go um, to the library and get more money. I want to go to class. Okay. That day you learned spells. Sick. They're cool, but useless. Spell to renew sticker stickiness. Spell to turn chocolate and vanilla ice cream into vanilla chocolate ice cream. Yeah, this class is useless. <laughs> Spell to gain plus two smarts. Do it. Kablammy. Nice. <clears throat> Afterwards, you notice. Oh, <laughs> every time. It's okay. That's okay. <laughs> Afterwards, you notice Scott huddled next to Vera. These two hardly ever hang out. You wonder what's up. Cry, you picked a terrible combo. I know. I know. <laughs> Scott seems to be showing Vera some kind of sports diagram. But we just keep losing football games over and over. Coach says we're just not sporting hard enough, but I'm sporting as hard as I can. I figured, since you're super smart and everything, maybe you could fix your entire team in 10 minutes. Well, obviously I can do that. I'm, I'm incredible. Listen, what you need is an oblique strategy, a new technique that your opponents won't expect. Like poison darts, or a vicious campaign of psychological warfare, or... or Now's your chance to impress them. Oh, Jump no. in with an idea that will show them how much you know about winning sports. Mm -hmm. Oof. Uh... What you guys need... It's blackmail material. One well-placed camera in the opposing team's locker room is all it takes. That's or is a player good. who's really a truck? <laughs> <laughs> the first one seems pretty bold. I feel like I could nail the first one, yeah. Do it. Let's go with that. Oh, it's a smart thing. Oh. oh. That's brilliant. Uh, yeah, that's what I meant to say. <laughs> it is? <laughs> yes, it is. Awesome. And what's more, I already have the infrastructure in place to accomplish this. What infrastructure? What are you talking about? Nothing, nothing. I definitely haven't planted cameras in the men's locker room, and I'm definitely not selling the compromising locker room nudes. Whoa, to compromising locker room nudes .com as a side business, that's for sure. Fear, you are sus as fuck. Super yeah. sus. <laughs> oh, that's good. Because if you were, that would be super mean. I indeed. Looks like you solved the problem and stumbled into Vera's underground porn empire. Mm. Nice. You gain plus two smarts and plus one creativity. Oh, that's sick. Oh, yeah. You're so smart. Puss. I know. Yo, uh, let's, uh, let's go to the bathroom. I gotta take a leak. <laughs> that day you skip class and just hang out in the bathrooms because you respect no authority. But you don't stop there. You want the world to know how reckless you are for the rest of eternity. So you do some graffiti on the wall. No way. The graffiti says, I'm bold as fuck. And you know what? It turns out the wall is a magical wall that grants wishes. What? What a wall. A deep voice resounds from in the wall and says, Well, not bold as fuck, but maybe a bit bold. And then you gain plus, plus two boldness. Oh boy. That's an opinionated wall. Anyway, lucky you. You notice Vera showing off an elaborate new necklace to Miranda. They're from the crown jewels of Lemuria. My family acquired them in a cutthroat business merger. Do you like them? Oh yes, very much. Such a shame about the Lemurian royal family though. What? That they're all dead at the hands of their own servants? No, no, that was all unavoidable once the true tragedy had taken place. They were no longer loved by their subjects. Feared, you mean? Oh no, fear is so scary. Love is what matters. I could not disagree more. 
Uh, you there, settle this dispute for us. What's the best way you let people know how powerful you are? Oh, oh man. Buy their houses, burn them down, then replace them with the water park. You don't need to convince anyone. Just make everyone who doesn't love you disappear. Oh shit, that's intense <laughs> as fuck. Second one. <laughs> Second one. Hell yeah. Ah, nice. uh, yes! That counts as smart. <laughs> Daddy strategy! The amazing thing is that once the bad people start to disappear without explanation, even people who used to be bad start being very good. It's like magic and so humane. Oh, it's so, to it's totally. Do you happen to know where your father put all those people who disappeared? Put them? No, silly. They disappeared like a magic trick. Ah, uh, yes. I see. You gain plus two charm and plus one smarts, as well as yet another reason to never visit Miranda's kingdom. It's a little um, scary over there. Sure. All right, here comes Big Suck sucking oh, it up. Here yeah, we go. Yeah, suck it all send you me vacuum the, cleaner. Uh, yeah, send me that, uh, library. We gotta get them dollars, dude? I gotta get them dollar bills. Listen, I've already lost stats. I can't, I can't, I can buy my way into back into this. <laughs> all right. All right. Brian's. Brian's. Uh, that, that day you spend some time on the library's PCs playing some good old online poker. Gambling seems like a stupid and dangerous decision. But who cares? This time it paid off, so fuck it. You gain plus two money. Dope. Out of the corner of your eye, you spot Scott and Miranda staring intently at a picture of a seahorse? This looks like a killer seahorse, Mary. What are you so worried about? Well, you see, one of my daddy's subjects gave me this horse as a gift. And well, you've heard what they say, haven't you? Don't look a gift horse in the mouth. What? Who are they? Why do they say that? What's in there? I don't know. That's why I'm so distraught. I'm terrified I will accidentally look into this gift horse's mouth and see. See what? A gross butt? Another tinier horse? A world without sports? I don't know. And I don't want to find out. Aw, uh, come on, Miri. You gotta find out. You gotta find out for... What's that thing Mrs. Ferrato always is talking about? Mrs. Nosferatu. Science? No. Oh. Yeah, for science. You got him, right? You realize Scott's looking at you for your opinion. They both are. What do you think Miranda should do? Uh, don't ever look that gift horse in the mouth. In fact, breed it with sea urchins to produce gift horses with tiny mouths. Oh, wow. <laughs> that gift horse right in the damn mouth. They only say not to because they don't want you finding all the delicious mouth candy. Um, the first one. I want tiny horses with tiny mouths. Okay. So hey, smart. Hey, I'm a smarty boy. Miranda is clearly pleased by your suggestion. When you run into her the next day, all her previous anxiety seems to have gone. I took your marvelous suggestion to the logical next level. I had my father's genetic wizards combine my gift horse with a sea urchin. Whatever horrible thing was lurking between those horse lips, <laughs> they're now too tiny for me to see it. The horse is a little bit spiny now, but I think that just adds to his charm. It's so cute. I can tell he loves it because of the deeply pained expression in his <laughs> tiny, watery eyes. It's like a pug. <laughs> <clears throat> that worked so well, you wonder why you don't solve all your problems with genetic manipulation. You gain plus two creativity and plus one smarts. Damn. Let's go. Damn. Not bad. All right, I gotta make all right, place. Icus. I gotta make place. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. I, I have either outdoors mm -hmm. for fun mm -hmm. or auditorium for creativity. Or creativity. buy something. I don't want to buy anything. I only have five money. I need more money. Okay. Okay. But someone uh, went to the, the library. The gym, is, here. the gym is charm, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. That day while rehearsing for the class play, it's as though the muses themselves had descended to give you figurative oral sex. I'll take it. Your performance <laughs> is intense and inspiring. It'll be remembered for generations, which is pretty rad by high school standard plays. Plus two creativity. Hell yes. Nice. Nice. Later in the halls, you run into Polly and Liam, who seem to be talking about some kind of flyer. The flyer is for an upcoming music festival, Howlapalooza. So, we agree on everything for Friday, right? 
Well, yes, pretty much. And Saturday, we should totally go to Messer Chups and imagine a fucking dragon. Sure, I mean, those bands are great. And then at 3 a.m., I want to check out that guy in the parking lot who makes a cacophony for two hours. <laughs> oh, Animal Collective. Um, ghosts are super into cacophonies, but at 3 a.m., I wanted to go to MC Griffin. I mean, it's a friggin' griffin that raps. It's the hottest shit right now, Liam. You know, the hottest shit right now isn't the criteria I use to pick the artists I want to see. A griffin that raps, Liam. Hello. Well, there should be a better way to decide this other than repeating our choices in a loud, annoying tone. But I love the loud, annoying tone thing. How it works. I know, but still. Go ahead, don't be shy. You might have the ultimate trick for how to choose the best schedule for this music festival. I don't know that I do! <laughs> Yo. Uh, get into as much Aya ha uh, Hoska as possible. Hoska. Oh, Jesus. Until some kind of spirit animal appears and shares its wisdom to you. Don't fight over this. The one who wins will get to see their artist live for an hour or two, but the one who loses... We'll get to bitch about it until the end of time. Hmm. That's true. Well, I know the Polly answer. That's true. Obviously, uh, but I want to win is what I want. Uh, although I did say I get Polly. Do I have the fun for Hiawaska? I, 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 yep. Uh, Hiawaska. Thank you. Thank you. Um, don't fight over this. The one who wins leaves their artist live for an hour or two. Shit, I'm going with that one. It's smart. <laughs> yeah. So there you smart. Go. Hmm, a solution that involves hating stuff in a public way. Count me in. I mean, you're actually right. I'm already getting to see stuff I enjoy. So, getting one hate watching session would be healthy for my cred. Usually, I can totally shit on stuff without really knowing a lot about it. But. Actually attending a concert. That is going the extra mile. Huh? So, can we go see MC Griffin? You bet, Paulina. It worked out somehow. <laughs> I'm going to practice my eye rolling and my sighing. Oh, sweetheart, you're dark to the point where you're actually lovable. Ah, oh, classic Liam. You solved the situation with your knowledge of hipster culture. You gain plus two smarts and plus one charm. Yeah, see? You keep getting things with Liam. What's going That's on? That's just who there? I am on the inside. <laughs> yeah, right? It's not my fault. As much as I want to be a Polly, I'm always going to be a Liam. Yeah. All right. What's going on, boy? All right. Boy. What's going on with you? All right. All right. You're hanging around with some of your absolute best buds. Ah. Or at least people who seem to tolerate you for now. What? <laughs> Miranda, Vera, Scott, Big Suck, and Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly, an interdimensional rift opens. Oh, no. Oh, no. Good God, this had better not be. Hello. Fear not, my loves, for it is I, the interdimensional prince, here to save you. Oh, uh, hi again, buddy. Hello. Damn. He's always so damn delusional. Hello. Wow. I certainly like my suitors to court me with... Great passion, of course, but ideally I prefer it done without attempting to kidnap me, which I have a feeling he's about to do. Kidnap you? Oh, my sweet strawberry daiquiri, I am here to save you. Save us from what, you lunatic? Why, your humdrum existence in this useless place of learning where no learning is done. From your repetitive adventures and mundane love-related tasks, I am here to take you somewhere entirely new. Somewhere full of unlimited choice. Soldiers! Rescue them! From out of the interdimensional rift pours an army of soldiers who surround Miranda, Vera, and Scott. For their own protection? Looks like you're going to need a, to re-rescue them from the unwanted rescue. Fighting against this many soldiers could be tricky, but luckily you're an expert at the most powerful soldier fighting technique of all. The dirty double dragon dance. Wow. Obviously. 
less. Luckily, your partner Pablo was killed after using the dance to save you from the three-headed cougar during Double Dragon 2. Pablo and Baboy are back. And you can't perform it alone. If you could, it wouldn't be called the Double Dragon Dance. Right. Time to grab one of your other friends to perform this bold and daring dance with you. But which one is up to the challenge? Oh, shit. Let me see those stats on the side. Listen, I am negative bold. Do not pick me. Oh, here's a memory. Oh, oh, yeah. That's good. That is good. That's very yo, good. Yo, yo, girl, listen. I'm negative I bold. I got you. We can, but what, we can but do I this. Think it's a dance. This is also creativity, right? But it's bold. But remember, it's bold. But it's also creative. Did it say I'm a creative it's, it's son of a bitch as well. Yeah, do it. Pick God. him. Do All me. Right, pussy. Pussy well, got hold on this. this. Hold on. Also, Big Suck, just so you're aware, you realize, yeah. is actually Pablo. Wait, Wait what? In that moment, you realize the shocking truth. Pablo survived the cougar attack, but was badly disfigured. He went through many rounds of plastic surgery and is now known as Big oh, Suck. Shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, my gosh. Why didn't I read that? <laughs> yeah, right? Okay, Pussy is so incredible at the Dirty Double Dragon Dance that she won Monsters Have Monstrous Talent with it. And her partner also seemingly died in a freak cougar accident. Your wow, both of these yeah. are good. Both of these are good. Pussy's got this. You know this. Do right. it, do it, do it, do it. Puss. I got you. It. So bold. There you go. So bold. The soldiers glare menacingly, surrounding your other three friends more closely. You and Puss link hands and begin the dirty double dragon dance. You do the worm, you throw axles, you twerk, and you twirl. Before too long, all the soldiers have been killed by dance. Wow. How dare you defeat my soldiers with that incredible, incredible dance. Come to think of it, maybe I'll marry B-Boy and Pussy. You're both very talented and very attractive. Thank you. I wish you luck in getting through this repetitive, repetitive, repetitive game of life. Oh, huzzah! Saved at last. That was a close one. Aw, uh, he's gone already? I'll miss him. He's so strong. I bet he could have been great on a sports team. Seriously, Scott, he's such a creep. But Says the girl who puts cameras in boys' locker rooms. It's not that big of a deal, all right? Listen. It, it, <laughs> you hit it, 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 it. <laughs> Gotta make more money somehow. Illegal. But he was Illegal. trying to rescue us. <laughs> I know, buddy. Come on, let's all go celebrate our freedom from freedom. Yes, thank you ever so much for saving us from being saved, b boy and pzzz. That dance was the awesomest. You'll have to teach it to me sometime. Then you all hear some kind of voice coming from nowhere, and the voice says, Double Dragon 3, b boy and pussy get double dates in theaters next Heck March. Yeah. Wow! Was that, like, a movie trailer thing? Are we really characters in a movie? Does that mean I'm the way underpaid female lead? Huzzah! Zing! <laughs> a narrator voiceover? Psh, that's flaccid, sloppy writing. What's this, a Charlie Kaufman movie? I'm out. Oh, and you both gain plus three boldness. Hey! We're bold. You guys are so yeah. effing bold! So fucking bold. Yeah. God damn! Here Everybody choose, choose a, a movie. movie. <sighs> Double Dragon. Oh. <laughs> Mario Brothers. Street Fighter. Why are they all video game movies? <laughs> Look, I game sorry, on right. game on right. Right. Mortal Kombat. You're stuck with Blood Ring. Oh, okay. Three? Right. Oh my god, Three. okay. Player orders decided based on how bizarre an action figure based on <laughs> They've all literally oh, had no. action figures. Shit. Oh man. You know what? A Mario Brothers action figure would be the most I gotta yeah. say Mario Brothers Go Mario. is the weirdest one. Like weird, like normal looking Bob Ho uh Bob Hoskins yes. action figure. Oh, that yeah. would not be okay. Yeah, that exists, by the way. Uh, um, I don't think I've ever, because Double Dragon hasn't been like a thing yeah. for a while. That's Double, true. Yeah. Double Dragon. Who I was Double Dragon? Was that you? Weird. That was yeah. That was B boy. B boy. B boy. And then it's gotta be gotta be cry. Would it be what was I yours mean, again? My Street Fighter. I mean, that's those like action the figures noir. are great. Yeah. I I have several over here. Yeah. Yeah, they're literally yeah. right next okay. to you. Okay. I'll take three. <laughs> We're almost halfway well, through go. our wooing. All right. <sighs> okay. I need, oh, she's outdoors. Shit. I just need more money. But I also want, I want to be smart. 
I mean, you're pretty <laughs> smart as you are. I'm right? very smart, but you guys have like double digit things, and I'm charm. I could always go on a charm offensive. Okay. She's so cute. That day, an epic dodgeball match takes place. Yeah, she's very determined. Mm -hmm. This guy, number one fan. Yes. Yo, yeah, oh, I love the Skelly Man. Yeah. I'm love not sure him. what she's doing, but I think she's like charging her power. Yeah, she's yeah, solar she's bomb. She's giving her spirit energy. Spirit bomb. Yeah, As yeah, yeah. all people with glasses have Do. powers that they charge. Yeah. That's fact. That's fact. Uh, the, the skeleton reminds me very much of uh, the way that Mike Mignola draws skeletons. Because yes, the way that absolutely. the eyes are. Yeah, totally. yeah, it reminds me of that. Yeah. But the match isn't as important as the human interactions within it. You're at your peak when you decide to go for the overkill and wink at one of your teammates. He's totally mesmerized. It's the most epic wink ever. Damn, you know how to win over people's hearts. You gain plus two charm. Yo! Nice. It's like I'm I'm a perfect mix of everything. Like I'm pieced together to make a perfect <laughs> person. Yeah. Mm. It's just like that. You notice Liam and Miranda talking to Coach. They actually seem to be enjoying Jim for a change. Oh my god, can I please be Coach? Something must sure. be terribly wrong. You go over to see what it is. Well now, I'm all for inspiring athleticism in the hearts of youth, but allowing you to take up your own sport seems a bit unorthodox, don't you think? Oh, but ordinary sports are ever so dull and unrefined. I'm sure we two could do much better. Uh, uh, <coughs> uh, hi. <laughs> hi, hello. Um... Yes, I've already got an idea, actually. I had an idea for a sport since before there were sports. I call it... Art. <laughs> no teams. No rules. Just pure creative expression. And I will be the quarterback. Obviously. Art! Brilliant! We'll play it with watercolors and sequins. And there shall be a sports bard and a goalie laureate and... It's good to see you kids getting enthusiastic about wholesome physical experience, but uh, I gotta say, art doesn't really sound like a sport. Well, it doesn't have the word ball in it anywhere. That's easily solved. We'll call it art ball. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, obviously that's much better, but let me ask you this. How do you score points in art ball, huh? Liam and Miranda both look at each other, totally stumped. Their dream hangs in the balance. Time to step in. Mm. Oof. Obviously, the sports <laughs> Boy, bard... Boy, inside us all along. <laughs> <laughs> uh, in the Atlantic, didn't you read the rule book? Don't you see? Yeah, I like that. God, I like that one. I really wish it was... <laughs> Maybe the points were the friends we made along the way. <laughs> <laughs> kicks the metaphysical linebacker who scores 11 points each poem. This is very detailed and probably requires a lot of smarts, but God damn it. Don't do you it. see? Whew. I believe in this. All right. Do it, do it, do it. Ooh, Ooh. So charming. Oh my God, you're right. I've become so obsessed with the points out there that I've forgotten about the points in here. <laughs> you kids have taught me a valuable lesson today. From now on, points are here in my band for most sporting events. Whoa. But still, I can forget I said this. Does that mean we can make Art Bell our ad <laughs> bow a varsity sport? A varsity sport? <clears throat> of course. The only real sport after all is togetherness. Liam and Miranda throw themselves into recruiting a team. Coach bans points. The way your team was doing this year, hardly anyone notices the difference. You gain plus two charm and plus one boldness. Yeah, nice. oh, your stats are pretty right. well rounded, dude. So dude. charming. Thank you. Uh, fuck, it's me. I don't even know who I'm going yeah, for. Yeah, at this point. You know what? It's week two. You don't have to know. You just have to I guess feel. so. It is only week two. Yeah. We're not trying to meta this. Well, at least I'm assuming and Also, you, you do have an awesome tattoo that may do. play a role in something. Who yeah. knows? I do have an awesome tattoo. You know what? Um, you should totally flop I... that tat in gym. Oh, wait, you can't go to gym. Never mind. <laughs> Fuck it. I can't go Damn to it. gym. I'm going to go to the library, though. The library? It's months. Yeah. Ooh. Look at oh, God. My. That guy's Are you catfishing? At... Damn. Don't worry no. about it. No, that he's clearly creating Overwatch porn. That's Widowmaker. Yeah. <laughs> I'd recognize Widowmaker's boobs anywhere. What that's is all it? The, that's all I do. Fuzz or something? Whatever. That day, you spent some time on the library PC, sending malicious spam emails in the hopes of stealing other people's money. 
Doesn't sound very nice, but I mean, who's really the one to blame if they respond to such a blatant scam? You lose karma, which isn't a stat in this game, so... <laughs> and you gain plus two money. Afterwards, you discover you've been poisoned, and only Vera has the antidote. Wow, the stakes what? just got raised. Yeah. She wow. does this all the time. It's how she invites you to hang out. Oh. Damn. There you are. Thank you for so much for coming. Uh, you're welcome. I'm embarking on a new criminal enterprise, and I need a consulaire. Con I was... I'm... Consling consigliere. 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 The idea is simple, <laughs> yet brilliant. Think Uber, but for killing people. Oh. I call it murder. Yes, go on. But it turns out that the market is flooded with assassination apps. Assassination apps and blood. I need a way to get ahead of the pack, and since you're such a good advisor. Oh. Differentiate yourself by being the only service that offers free range organic <laughs> murders. Viral marketing. Literally, tailor a highly contagious virus to make people love murder. That sounds bold. Um, that sounds good. Yeah. Okay. Virus. You can do that? Great. You can use my private chemical weapons laboratory. Oh. And so... This is working better than I ever could have imagined. Demand for murder has gone through the roof since you released that virus. I got you, baby. Sure. The side effects include vomiting, bloody tears, male lactation, cobra feet, time dilation, rigor mortis, and rectal teeth. Rectal teeth? Renegade spleen, microaggressions, sudden tattoos, hair trauma, liquefaction, coughing. But it's well worth it for the profits I'm raking in. Plus, I'm making a literal killing selling people the antidote for all these side effects. Why is my robot talking? I don't know. It's not actually the antidote, though. It's actually just heroin. Same difference. <laughs> Did you know that they used to give heroin to babies as a cough suppressant? Yeah, the real world is exactly as immoral as this video game. <laughs> but whatever you gain, plus two creativity and plus one money. Ooh, Damn, we got some baller that? stats. Damn. Shit. All right. Shit. I'm falling behind. Uh, I'm going to go to... Uh, let's just round it up a little bit. Let's go to... The yes. Yes. yes auditorium. Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah, let's do it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That day while rehearsing for the class play, you do a terrific job at acting. Well done. You act so hard that some of your classmates in the audience throw roses at you. Seven roses to be exact. Damn. Roses aren't a valid currency or stat in this game. Anyway, you check your converter app to see if this could translate into something a bit more useful. Hmm, it seems seven roses equals two creativity points. Sweet, you gain plus two creativity. You catch Miranda posing in front of a mirror, gazing dreamily at her reflection. Oh, how I would love to win the talent show. Of course, Daddy pays a dozen peasants to tell me how talented I am every morning, but that's not the same. After all, they're peasants. No, to hold that heavy, spiky trophy in my hands, or rather to have my servants hold it. <laughs> oh, that would make me the happiest princess in all the land. But I'm so nervous. What if they don't like my song? What if my skin is too scaly? What if I accidentally say a swear? <gasps> Oh. Hecky. <gasps> Miranda, be calm. Remember what Daddy says. If you don't calm down, failure is 100% assured. That's not helping. Now I'm even less calm. Yeah, fancy that. Yeah. Looks like Miranda caught it, is caught in a vicious cycle. Quick, help her out before she worries herself to death. Shit. Okay. Don't worry about those chumps in the audience. If they don't love you, then they're untalented at recognizing talent. Or, I know a great chick for beating stage fright, just picture everyone naked. Hmm. That sounds kind of bold. I feel like the first one is charming. That's my, that's Both my- Both your stats are sense. very high. I they feel are. like- I think I might be good yeah. for either one, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's find out. Let's go for the naked one. Sure. Yes. Ooh. So bold. This face right here is her imagining that. Yeah, she's like, wow, that's yeah. really good. I like this whole, mm, whole lot. Everyone's naked. I, um, was I supposed to be picturing you naked? Right now at this moment? 
Damn. Because uh, I seem to have done so. <laughs> Damn. Entirely by accident. So bold. But it was not unpleasant. In any case, I'm calm now. I must run away. Goodbye. Hell yeah. Miranda does nice. indeed make a break for it, but as she goes, she casts a hungry glance over her <laughs> shoulder. Nice. You gain plus two charm and plus one. Shit, can I just take oh, both the Slayer dude. and Miranda to the prom? Fuck it. Nice. I like the, like, nice. nice. Send, me the, send me the shop. I'm going to spend some of this muns. Oh, okay. Outdoors. I am, I am floundering. Show me that money. Uh, Russian accent? Oh, please? hello, yes. Let us face it, you are probably <laughs> going to end up losing money in stupid ways, so why not lose stupid here? It's called being smart. <laughs> yeah, she's an exchange student. Yeah, she is. Hello. All right, let's see. Buy me the fucking Do dragon it. novel. Yes. Give it to I'm me. I'm so glad Give you are. Give it to me. Dragon Heat, oh. a classic. I want to know what this does so badly. Catch you later. Samesies. Mm. I'm always with people. Hey, great. Cool. Dope. Okay. All right. Money Amazing. spent. Everybody choose a food. Five dollar food long. Uh, day old pizza. Pierogi. Oh, pierogi. Just one. Oh, pierogi. Pierogi. How powerful. Oh, what? Energy. No, no. I mean, oh. water. Here's the thing. Water <laughs> dilates it. Water's last place. That's, mm, okay, yeah. fair enough. I'll take that. Uh... I mean, I I drink a five dollar foot long energy drink. I get tired from carbs, so. Oh yeah. Uh, pizza is all a day old pizza that energizes anyone's life. That's true. It's also very that's convenient. Just, that's just a fact. Yeah, that's just a fact. I mean, a foot, a foot, a five dollar foot long. It's cheap too, so it could be a cheap energy drink as well. Just saying. I mean, that's true. Yeah. But like, how much do you trust a cheap energy drink? Not a lot. <laughs> that's how you. That's how you get like pancreatitis. I think Jesse's got first. Yeah. I'll take it. I'm not going to argue with that. Boom. Done. I'll let you guys pick Listen, the rest. I believe Pierogi you. energy drink. Oh, I'm just telling I, you right now. That sounds delicious. Right? Yeah. Well, that's all yeah. potatoes and that's all it's so carbs. Smooth. It's all carbs. All right. Yeah. Big, yeah. big suck second. Big suck. Give it to puss, me. Puss master Give me the three. big suck. All right. And then Done. The Easy. For Perfect. Easy. Um, not to reference something Let's from go. so long ago. But oh, Jesus, the prince is here. Yeah, he is. Oh, no. I'm so That handsome gorilla was not very handsome. That anyway, <laughs> keep going. Yes, he was. Yes, he is. Look at his face. He looks like a normal-ass gorilla. I just <laughs> need everybody who's watching to handsome know. Handsome Japanese gorilla. You know, where's the payoff? Bring the strippers and boots. We do occasionally talk about video games. Bring the strippers and boots. Out of that time of video games. Bring the strippers and boots. Oh, thank God. I don't need pants now. Hey, JC, what are you doing? Not much. Making a fortune. It's a production of broadcast. Yeah, now sing the music. It's a production of broadcast. Bring the strippers and boots. It's a production of broadcast. Now here's to ask and answer one simple question. It's a production of broadcast. Mm -hmm.